great pageantry here in this sea of burnt orange. 95,000 strong as they play in the eyes of Texas. It is college football primetime presented by Applebee's and a Turkey Day tradition renewed. These teams have not met on Thanksgiving since 93, but it goes way, way back. We don't buy his explanation that it's only about winning. It's about winning convincingly. And believe me, he'd like to have this thing salted away by the third quarter. <laughs> Randy Bullock. True freshman to kick it away for Texas A&M, and we are underway. Aggies won the toss to Bird to the second half. And taking a knee, and Shipley in the end zone. So here comes Shipley's with, with six DBs on the field every snap. It's what they are right now on third and 11 as McCoy has plenty of time. Flyers complete, and making the diving catch is Juan Cosby, the senior. Now it's third and eight. You fake it to Obanaya. McCoy. This is what he's done so well all season. Has the first down into Aggie territory. Leading rusher on this team. Produces 10 yards that bunch for a quarterback who's mainly a thrower. And McCoy keeps it. That looks like the old zone option read that Vince Young ran so well. They get eight more. <laughs> you know, Cody Johnson, the short yardage you know, touchdown specialist. On first down. This is Whitaker again. Shows the quick feet. Picks up six. And you have to expect in this football game. This is Whitaker. Whitaker behind a wall of blockers just plowing inside the 15. A show of force by the Texas offense. Going against Will Muschamp's defense, their own teammates, it forced them to get better. And he show pressure. McCoy keeps it. Go McCoy. Touchdown. The extra point. And this is Ryan Bailey. So, no review. The ninth rush. DeAndre Smith, the running back, is in as a receiver on third down. Quick drop for Johnson, and he tries to throw a slant to Jeff Fuller, the true freshman receiver. And he. Five feet. <laughs> you see guys on both sides slipping a lot. Yeah. Whitaker cuts it back to the left. And he tripped up. Whitaker on the third and four. So for the Aggies to get Texas off the field here, they bring pressure. McCoy slipping again and drops. He's really having trouble setting up to throw. In fact, second and 12. You think it to Keandre Smith. Johnson is dropped on the edge. Deion Beasley, the corner, got him. 23. Johnson, it's a shovel pass, and Goodson couldn't hold on. And pressure came very from third and nine. Immediate pressure, it's a screen. Cosby breaking three. Quan Cosby has a first down. Now check it, it's Brandon Collins on the catch. They use that little screen. This time they rush only three. McCoy fires low and complete. It's a first down. You got to worry about all the receipts catching McCoy's passes. Colt keeps it, slings it. Collins cut down to the 20-yard line, but it's another first down. Once again, the Aggies bring only three. McCoy ran right up into the pressure, stays alive, and will be dragged down short of the first down by Matt Featherston. Colt, regular kicker for. Most of the last couple of years, he's been splitting time, and this one is wide left. Missed it from 30. DeAndre Smith on third and 12. McGee pressured immediately, throws it into the middle of a big pasture of grass. Ryan Arakpo was in his face. Buy those things, right? His like birthday, five, six grand on the pitch. This is Bondro McGee hammering forward. Took the pitch from McCoy's little so option McGee. on the pitch. And third and three, McGee has it again. Bondrell McGee breaks an arm tackle and gets a first down. McGee on the carry. Well, Featherston had a chance to wrap up. It's Obanaya to the left of McCoy on third and six. McCoy takes off, gets a block, spins and sidesteps for another first down. All seasons like they're coming with three. They bring late pressure. McCoy fires complete over the middle. Down into the end zone. Touchdown. Brandon Collins got it. He paid the price.
didn't he? And make a switch and kicker. Now Hunter low. Clean it up. On third and 15. Pressure. They flip it to Goodson in the flat. Gets a block. And Mike Goodson takes off down the sidelines. Finally shoved out. Earl Thomas saved the touchdown. <laughs> they had zero net yards until that play. Picked up 54. McGee hammered as he gets it away. But it's complete. So far, it's been working. Look how tight they are in there. Bunched up. Make sure they protect inside out. Kindle. Lester again. This is big guy Lane in a, a short game. And if you got big old Lane in there, and he's got it. Jaworski Lane hit in the backfield. He won't get it. Roderick McElroy hit him. He'll be a yard four on the play clock now from 37 yards. They just do get it away. And he knocks it through. So he's six of six on the seat. No, Jesse, you've had a loss today. We'll get into that a little bit later. <laughs> McCoy fires across the middle. An accurate strike to Cosby. 14 of 16. The guy is 77% passer coming in. There's another completion. This is Collins ducking inside the 30. McCoy steps up. Tries to scamper, staying alive. Fires late. Now it's complete to Obanaya, who dances out at the nine. Almost across the On first and goal. Again, McCoy, pump fake. Breaking free, fires end zone, touchdown! Ron Cosby. Quarter that can get open in the end zone. Hunter Lawrence. The line drive conversion. So the Aggies had a chance to get momentum settled for turn. Thanks. I guess it's relative terms. McGee versus Johnson moving the ball. It's McGee escaping here. Puts a short pass and a first down. DeAndre Smith still running into Texas territory. It was McGee's turn to flirt with that line of scrimmage before getting it. When Collins Station a year ago against Texas. McGee keeps it. Steps up and fires off short. This is Tannehill breaking free in. Ryan Tannehill, the freshman inside the 30. This is Goodson in motion. Sets up to the left of McGee. And he gets the ball on the screen. And that was the lone production. Take it to Smith. And McGee slips and is hammered. Sergio Kindle got him. And you see McGee chase him down. Stephen McGee has walked over to the top. Add to their point total right here from their 20 on first down. McCoy keeps it, fires downfield. Cosby. You have to think they've been softening up this defense now for where they are right now without Colt McCoy. Wouldn't be the same football team. <laughs> you think? Not even close. <laughs> this is Collins in the slot. Brandon Collins, a big night, breaking free. Whitaker, the back, blocking way downfield. And off the Bondrell McGee in a quick burst. McCoy keeps it. Has a crease. Colt McCoy! Touchdown number two. touchdowns, two touchdown passes. And for Lawrence, still perfect on the season in PATs. Same name. They take it to him. McGee, look downfield, now fires across the middle, and the catch is made by Jeff Fuller. He has a first down. Yeah, he was close to being knocked woozy in the first half as McGee fires along the sidelines, and a nice diving catch by Terrence McCoy. So... McGee in a bit of a rhythm here, but the hole just keeps going in front of the Longhorns and both of the poles that make up the BCS and the AP poll as well, for that matter. And, and they were behind Texas. Conference. Third and 14, McGee has time, delivers. It's caught. Fighting back towards his quarterback was Jeff Fuller, but he gave up a lot of yards to Blake clock at three and fourth and seven. And a first down. He flipped it to Keandre Smith out of the backfield, and he's inside the 25. Off the first for Texas. 
McGee still has it, and he is hammered. Ryan Palmer on the corner blitz. Designed to the play there to keep your quarterback from getting hammered on the blind side. McGee, a shot downfield, robbed it for Tannehill, but he was well covered, and it was well overthrown. Right. From 49 yards, Brantley boots it. Will it get there? Nope. Missed it wide right. You think they'll be crazy, though, at home? I think they'll be cranked up at research. Absolutely. Yeah. McCoy fires over the middle. Shipley. Jordan Shipley. Gets a block. Heads to the end zone. And it's shut down at the two. Roommates took it up. Longhorn thought that Shipley got the pylon. They're pleading their case in the corner. You remember it up in front of Obanaya. Muscling into the end zone for a touchdown. Big old Cody behind the block from the defensive tackle is 11th rushing touchdown this season. <laughs> D. Lyman loves that. Get in there, be part of a touch. 300 leading 260 pounds into the end zone. Set up by the long catch of. They bring some heat. Dumps it off low and a nice shoestring catch by Tannehill at the 30. Three yards here, or else Texas is going to have a very short field. It's complete for a first down. Tannehill, and to his credit, coming to AM thinking. Take it to Kendra Smith. Tannehill, the quarterback, thinks about throwing, but he'll be sacked and loses the ball. Henry Melton got the fumble. First turnover of the game, and Tannehill not making a strong case for the 0-9. This is big Cody Johnson. A chance to carry it, not from the one, but he reaches the end zone anyway. Well, the short yardage specialist with his longest run of the season. And here's Hunter Lawrence. And check out the run of the season for Cody. The boot by Tucker. Cyrus Gray. Gets a little bit of a hole. And the speedy freshman. Gets a couple blocks downfield. And is finally shoved out of bounds. Not by Colt McCoy, but the other number 12, Earl Thomas versus McCoy versus Tebow. And Gerard Johnson fires to the end zone and touchdown. He found Jeff Fuller. And the true freshman beating Deion Beasley. And finally, the Aggies find the end zone. Takes off design run, but the horns were ready for it, and Johnson is stopped short. Earl Thomas on the tackle, even the president elect. This is Johnson, and the big man breaking free. Cody Johnson into Aggie territory, and he didn't want to run out of bounds. <laughs> Childs feeds it to him again. Johnson hammering forward. It'll be near the first down marker at the 10-yard line. One thing Mac Brown's head coach here. I think so. Where else is he going to go? Wait 10 years. He's only 47 years old. And if it's handed over when he's 47, he's got a pearl. Cody Johnson hammers down near the two. I ask that because, look, you can, you can give him a, a designate head coach type. Backstabbing him with this title. Here's Big Cody going for the hat trick. No, check it. Childs keeps it and walks in. The Aggies fool is the backup quarterback. Directs a touchdown drive and gets into the end zone. Right with that field goal attempt earlier. Knocks this one through. 40 point lead. To use it next year. A lot of young football players. It'll take a couple of years. He certainly looks the part, though. And tips up downfield. There's a first down out near the 50. Well, I see the bucket come right at him. <laughs> now they bring pressure on Johnson. And one more sack for Mustamps defense. 
back also. I bet there's going to be a guy. That's the guy. <laughs> Will got it too. <laughs> now the two-game losing streak to the Aggies is over. Must champ mob by his defensive guys.